hello everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is Joma for those that are new i'm a content creator based in ontario canada um if you don't mind please as you watch my videos smash the like button so that youtube can recommend my video to other people subscribe share like okay so let's get into today's video i'm going to be giving you guys a little information on how to migrate to canada as a nanny or caregiver uh caregiving job in canada so guys this program has really been ongoing and um it started again in january 1 2022 and um canada needed about in, in like in total of 5500 applications that is what they need and um and this 5500 application is split into two one part is 2750 application for home child um care provider pilot program and the two thousand the other 2750 application is for home support worker pilot program and this program like i said started in january 1 2022 so um really that this is a very good opportunity for those that wants to migrate to canada so i'm going to be sharing with you guys some requirements for this pilot program um what you what you need to prepare for you know because um the last time i was trying to ask somebody and then the person was like it's like this pilot program thing is full for this year because people are really ready to like people are working towards it ahead of time so you don't need to start working towards it when they say this January. That is when you start um, 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 compiling your document. So this is something that they have, they have pre-planned already. So and um, I would advise anyone that will be interested in this program, if this year um, pilot program has been full already, that you have selected the number of people they wanted and um, you're hoping to apply for next year, I will advise you guys to use this year as an opportunity for you to gather all your documents together put them in order so that next year january 1 to win it 23 january 1 pam you start applying like as soon as possible so you can be selected because you have limited number of people that will be selected so i'll be showing you guys some i'm tell, I'll be telling you guys some requirements for these pilot programs and number one is clb5 number two is one year of post-secondary education number three is job offer in canada as a nanny you get a job offer in canada as a nanny Number four is evidence of ability to ex execute the job. That is evidence of the relevant previous work experience, paid or unpaid. So, for example, employer reference letter, uh, employment contract, employment record, pay stops, and etc. So these are part of these are the requirements. And let's take um, a look at the. Um, at um, what the process would be so the step one of the process is that the application for permanent residence from overseas you understand you apply for permanent residence from overseas the receipt of work authorization to arrive in canada then you will have to work for two years then you now get your permanent residence in canada so these are some of the procedures so i'm going to be leaving um where you can get jobs in Canada as a nanny, in case if you don't have anyone in Canada who can send you a job offer, I'm going to be leaving the website uh, in my description. I'm also going to be leaving the um, website of the um, um, caregiving jobs. So like I told you before, if this year is full already, I would advise you guys to start um, compiling your document against the next year so that from once it's open January 1, you will be the first set of people that will apply and will be selected. So guys, that's all I have for this video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking. Thank you for sharing. Yeah, for those that would share, thank you for sharing. For those that would like, thank you for liking. And um, feel free, oh God, feel free to um, watch my other videos on how to migrate to Canada. I have a lot of videos on how to migrate to Canada. Feel free to check them out and um, leave a comment also. All right, thank you guys for watching. And I'm going to see you guys in my next video. All right, bye.